Hi guys, welcome to CA Final SCMP Self Paced Papers. We are trying to do the MCQs of standard costing. Now, do remember in your self paced paper, MCQs are going to be pay playing a very important part. We are trying to be doing all the MCQs that are there in the module. Once that is done, all the new MCQs which are related to case studies will also be done. So, let's start to be doing them. Now, the question in this case is something like this. The total fixed overhead variance, this is CA inter staff here, is, okay, four options. Measure the lack of production volume, okay. B, amount of under applied or over applied fixed overhead cost. C, cost reduction achieved from difference in production. And lastly, measure of production efficiency. Think of the correct answer before I will say the logic. Think. Okay, so, uh, I think so that the question talks of total fixed overheads cost variance. I think so they are talking of absorption costing. Because if it was marginal costing, those guys will only be talking of expenditure variance. Okay. Option number A is measure of lack of production volume. I think they are referring to volume variance under fixed overheads. Fixed overheads volume variance. How do you compute that? How much output should have been produced minus how much output was produced into absorption rate. So therefore, A cannot be the answer because A is basically fixed for its volume variance. Same way, C part is exactly same as A part only, might be just, just the different words, but then meaning is exactly same. Cost reduction achieved from difference in production. So therefore, that is exactly part A only. Part D, measure of production efficiency. They are referring to, they are referring to fixed over its efficiency variance. How many hours you should have taken for actual output minus how many hours you all took for actual output. Okay. So A, C and D cannot be the answer. Then B has to be the correct answer. That is amount of overheads under or over applied. Let me explain also. That will be far better. Uh, how do you compute total fixed overheads cost variance? There's a first variance that we all have done. That is nothing but absorbed amount minus actual amount. How do you compute absorbed amount? Beta? Absorbed amount is actual output into absorption rate. How do you compute absorbed amount? That is nothing but actual output into absorption rate minus in this case actual amount. And that ultimately will be giving you absorbed amount that I've written over here minus the actual amount that I've written over here. And this was nothing but under or over absorption. Under and over absorption is called by three different names. Under or over absorption, under or over recovery or under or over application. Okay, so out of all the answers, answer as I've already uh, highlighted should be B over here. Nothing else is possible. So B is the correct answer. That's it. 